Hey everyone, um, welcome to this week's plan with me. Um, this one's just going to be a fast forward. I'm pre-planning this week and I'm using this printable kit from Beautiful Planning. This is actually a freebie on her site and um, I kind of liked just how this was laid out and I had this leftover paper. This is the Weatherproof Glossy for Inkjet from um, Online Labels. You can't really see it, but it has like this iridescence to it that I don't love. It makes the stickers look kind of weird. So I only had two extra sheets. It took me forever to figure out the right cut settings for this. And in the end, I just kind of guessed because I was tired of messing with it. Um, but if you're wondering, Blade 3, Speed 3, Thickness 14, Double Cut was the only thing that worked with this. I tried like, I tried up to, what was it, cut, um, I want to say like 20 or something, or 19 or 20 for thickness level, and it still didn't cut through, so I'm like, lower it, double cut, it should be fine. And it was. So, um, the one thing that I do like about this kit is the way that it's laid out. So, this is literally your date cover, uh, top three header, um, she has her three heart checklist and half box linked together. Um, there's, uh, a lined label that would cover the header box, a full box, another line label, a half box, and then two quarter boxes. Um, so yeah, I just like how simple this is. Like, can't fuck this up. Okay, so we're going to switch over to a voiceover, um, just because... This is just a basic kind of plan with me, and the kit was a little different, but um, I can just talk through it. But I really wanted to do the fall tag. Um, I saw the Daisy Den um, uploaded her video last night, I want to say. By last night, I mean Sunday, so I don't know when this video is going to go up. Um, but it was just like super funny, and I've been wanting to do it, and I actually tried to do it in another video, but like legit after two questions got distracted because I cannot multitask. Um, but yeah, so all I've done so far for the spread is the bottom washi and then my camera is confused. Um, but yeah, it just, it's so cute with the candy. And then I'm going to go in with the, um, there's a little strip of washi sticker. It's not really washi. It's a, it's a sticker. Anyways, so there's a little sticker that goes on top. I really think it just like complements the bottom washi so well and adds a little pop of color. Um, but yeah, it's just like super, super cute. So let's get to the questions. So question number one is your favorite fall scent. Um, if we're talking Bath and Body Works candle, um, leaves hands down like all the other basic girls in the world. Um, but if we're talking just, well, I mean, okay. If I can't say leaves, um, I would say last year they had a candle that was like pumpkin cupcake because I really love anything like sweet vanilla-y. Um, that's really good. So any kind of pumpkin scent that's also kind of sweet, I'm into that. Um, and then I also got one this year and I maybe it's fall. I don't know. It's like a, to me it's like fall winter, um, but it's warm apple pie and it like it has like the crust like lingering scent in the background blowing my mind like literally blew my mind the first time I smelt it and I had to get it so um, I finished the sidebar in the time that I talked about the first question um, but all I did was a checklist and then a half box and then a couple of shorter checklists at the bottom as well um, but now I'm moving on to these half ombre heart checklist, half half box boxes. Um, and you can kind of see, like as I was laying down the stickers, the kind of weird iridescence this, that this paper has. It's like so strange. Uh, but it's like really nice paper though. Like um, it's thick enough that like when you peel up a sticker, like it sticks all the way back down. And then like some glossy stickers, like, like cheap glossy stickers, like sometimes when you peel them, they like wrinkle, which is like, I don't know. It just looks awful. And then obviously it doesn't stick down after that either. Um, but I just have those down and then <laughs> I put the top three header at the top. 
Um, and then I'm going in with the full boxes in the middle because the way that this kit was laid out, there's like a, um, maybe like a quarter box label. Yeah, what I'm putting down right now. Um, I'm putting this down and like putting it up against the top sticker um, and it overlaps a little bit on the middle sticker. And then I'll do the same thing on the bottom. So once I have like my bottom row stickers down, I line it to um, the bottom, like the top of the bottom box sticker and it overlaps on the middle again. So that's how that works. Um, but now that I've explained what's gonna happen in like the next couple of minutes, I can go on to the next question. Um, so best way to spend, spend a rainy day, um, in bed, either reading uh, and cuddle up with a dog or watching Netflix and cuddle up with a dog on a rainy day. Cause he doesn't like rain, so he has to be cuddled up with me. Um, my favorite fall drink. Um, I, I do love a good pumpkin spice latte. I can't have them all the time. I can only have them on occasion. Uh, I don't know what's happening. Okay. <laughs> Um, and then, I don't, I don't know, that's, I mean, I don't love pumpkin spice lattes. Ooh, hot chocolate. Can we go with that? Cause that's also a really good like thing that I only really drink in the fall and winter. Um, but I can't wait for winter, Christmas to come back when that chestnut praline latte comes back to Starbucks. Ooh, that's my jam. If you haven't had it, you need to try it. It's so good. So, so good. Um, yeah, so I have this whole first section done and it looks super cute. I am pretty excited at how it turned out and I really don't think I knew what to expect, but I'm just going with the date covers and getting those down. It really just oh, it pulls everything together. I'm so excited for how this is going to finish. So we're going to move on to the second half of the week and we're going to move on to more questions. Question number four, football, yay or nay? Mm, not really, but kind of. So I'm doing fantasy football this year, so I'm only <laughs> interested as far as the people on my team. Um, I think I've watched one football game so far this season. I'm still not into it. I really just think to them, think of the football players as means to winning, because I just, I just want to win. I really don't know all the rules and how it works, but... I'm just trying to win and I won like my last three games so I'm pretty jazzed that reminds me I don't know how my team's doing tonight it's Monday night right now um so I'm just starting at the bottom um, on this side and I'm doing the two there's two boxes and then there's little there's other icons in the kit that I'm gonna use later in the week to kind of fill it out um, as needed and then I'm putting the half box above the two boxes and then the label to cover the header box and it kind of overlaps a little bit on the middle box. So that's happening there. Um, question number five, favorite article of clothing this fall? I love a good scarf. Also, I love all the sweaters. Like I'm really into scarves and sweaters. Um, haunted house, haunted hayride, or haunted corn maze? I live in Iowa, so corn maze wins by default. Haunted houses creep me out, so I am not interested in that. Um, but yeah. No, not into that. Um, scariest movie I've ever seen. The Conjuring? No, I'm not gonna watch that again. Um, favorite candy to eat on Halloween is... Ooh. I mean, you're just asking my favorite candy. I would say it's a three-way tie between Reese's Cups Snickers and Kit Kats. Those are my three favorite candies in case you're wondering. Um, what will you or your kids be this year? I don't have any kids and I don't really, I'm not really doing anything for Halloween. I think I'm gonna hang out with my nephews. Um, I don't think they've decided what they're gonna be this year so I should probably call and figure out what that is. Um, favorite fall recipe. I would say I had like a like a pumpkin bread is what I would say. I was gonna say it's like a pumpkin and banana bread. It's just a pumpkin bread. That's all it is. Um, I really like that. 
I thought that said, what's your fall, what's your favorite fall thing about fall? What? It just says, what's your favorite thing about fall? Um, the leaves changing, them falling, the crunch when you walk, kind of the crisp air, the fact that I get to wear jackets. Um, those are all things that I enjoy. Um, so yeah. And that's the whole fall tag. Um, I finished that and I feel like a reasonable amount of time. Um, it really helped that this is a very monotonous <laughs> um, plan with me where I was just kind of doing the same thing for every day. But I'm just finishing up by doing my headers. And then I'm gonna go in with the date covers after that. Um, I don't really love that I didn't have like my backing board that I normally have for this, it's just on my desk. It, se it just seems like outside of my planner is like a vast sea of blackness. <laughs> when it's actually just like a really dark brown desk, so I don't know why it looks black, but whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm just finishing up with these date covers and I think this week turned out so cute. So cute. And I'm just showing you what I have left over. There are a couple of, whoa, oh, I wasn't sure what kind of pen I was gonna write on this. And both of these pens work. One of them is the Sharpie pen. The other one is a U Brands Porous pen. Um, I think I'm reluctant to use my Porous pen on it because um, on my premium matte stickers, my Porous pen dries out. So I just, I don't like using it on anything other than regular paper. Cause I feel like anything else might dry it out and that's, the really nice pens otherwise. So I put the dates down and then I'm showing you what's left. Those are the icons I was talking about earlier and then there are a couple of um, quarter boxes that I'm going to put on um, put on days as I need them. Okay guys so that is it for this plan with me. Thank you so much for um, hanging out with me and listening to me ramble on about my favorite things about fall um, while watching a plan with me video. Um, but if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you're interested in see the other content that I have on my channel, um, by all means, go ahead and subscribe. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.